Good afternoon and welcome to Retro Carty. This is episode 24 of the free video game collection. So, over the last few months we've been accumulating quite a lot of voucher. So I had a bit of a voucher blowout. So as you can see from the big pile there, the, from the Wii U game upwards, that was all voucher. And the bottom three games, I paid cash for those £2 in total, but we'll get to those shortly. Okay, so the first thing I bought was this World Cup 98 game on the N64. So that was £2 uh, from CX, so I used voucher for that. Uh, the next thing was uh, Super Mario 2 on the 3DS. That one was the most expensive, that was £15, but like I said, I used a voucher. All these games are games that I, I'm going to play, so that's why I don't mind using the voucher. The next thing I bought was this Predator DVD, Steelbook, two disc edition, really nice condition. And uh, that was £1.50. So I haven't got any Steelbooks. Uh, I'm not sure if I want to keep it or not. Uh, they are selling for about £10 to £15 on eBay. So that was one of the reasons why I bought it. So this was in with the normal DVDs. Normally uh, CX have got like a little bit of a steel book collection for uh, Blu-rays, but not for DVDs. So always scan the DVDs and you might find a little cheeky steel book like I did. Yeah, so £1.50 and it's in really good condition. Like I say, two discs, really good condition. So we'll see with that one. Okay, the next thing I bought was uh, a Wii game. So this is quite interesting. Uh, Mario and Sonic at the London 2012 Olympic Games. Now this was eight pound on the voucher yet. Yeah, that's right, eight pound. Uh, so really, again, really nice condition. I like the yellow case. It stands out well on the shelf with the rest of the normal white games. And I think uh, this is gonna go up uh, in value. So yeah, that was another reason. I think the Olympics is on this year. So yeah, I think it's on every four years. So 24 we're in now, yeah. So yeah, that's only gonna go one way and that's up in my eyes, but yeah, really good condition. Uh, I bought another Wii game. So this was £1.50 on a voucher. Now, the only reason why I bought this, well, one, I think it'd be quite fun to play with the kids, but also the artwork on it is absolutely amazing. Loved it, Dr drew me straight into it. And for £1.50, you can't complain. And like I said, all complete inside, really nice condition. You know what I'm like with a Wii U game? So if there's a Wii U game that I've not got in the collection and I see it and it's nice and complete and clean, I will buy it. So I did and I used six pound voucher. So yeah, great. Another one to the collection, another one. Now there is one thing to note that you don't get the Amobi cards with this, but that was stated on the uh, on the thing. But yeah, uh, Pokemon Tournament on the Wii U. Yeah, another one off the list. Okay, and then the final three uh, things were from a place or a shop called CGX. Uh, it's a bit like a cross between CX and uh, cash converters. So at the moment they've got three media or three video games, sorry, for two. So if you buy two, you get one free, basically. Uh, I've been in there before, a couple of episodes ago. I've pretty much bought what I've already wanted, but I thought I'll have a quick look again. Uh, no new games, but I'm spending a little bit more time going through them, and I decided to pick these three up. So they were one pound each, so basically two pound because I got the Cars game free. And as you can see there on on the receipt, so yeah. Uh, I picked the car game, cars game up. Uh, the reason why I picked this up is because it was nice condition. The book was inside. Uh, the disc is a little bit scratched, but it is a five pound game. So for free, can't really complain. So uh, I reckon, I don't think CX will take the disc, but the might if it's been run through a disc cleaner, but like I say, it's not really worth it at this moment time to sell you a five pound game. Uh, they'll give you two quid vouchers, something like that. So yeah, okay, fair enough. Uh, 
this one, uh, not a very expensive game. I think it's about one fifty game, one pound fifty. Uh, but like I say, it was in there. It was nice and complete. I have cleaned these up slightly. They were a little bit uh, dusty, as we say. And the final one was uh, Call of Duty Modern Warfare 3. A £4 game. So, yeah. So basically, £10.50 is worth of, worth of games there for, for two quid. So I can't really complain. So, yeah, overall, a nice little haul uh, for this episode. Uh, I'm going to briefly uh put some of these on on the shelf uh i've got kind of a a nintendo shelf up and running i say shelf it's more of a bookcase uh i think i've put a few pictures on on the uh on the channel at some point on a few of the previous episodes so i'm just working on that the games room is work in progress i haven't got the space all the all the time at the minute to proper dig it out and and really do it from scratch but yeah so yeah the Wii so on on the uh, Nintendo shelf I've got Wii U Wii GameCube and Switch and 3DS so yeah uh, I'm going to buy a couple more sh uh, bookshelf type things, maybe a Billy one or something like that from Ikea to get that game room. But yeah, stand by for a few more videos uh, coming up in the future about the games room. Uh, yeah, so that's the end of this episode pretty much. Uh, financials wise, obviously we've spent quite a bit of voucher there. I think we spent about £34 on a voucher, but we've got a couple of decent games there those two and and the Wii so that's not too bad I've spent two pound in total so uh budget wise I think we're negative 20 pound but I've got a plan for that uh because I've been sorting out a few bits I've got a few things to sell uh and the voucher is about 20 pound as well we've got 20 pound voucher left after spending that 34 pound so yeah all good Okay, have a good weekend. Catch you there. Bye-bye.